Hello, in this IP Foxy tutorial, I will show how to set up proxy in Ads Power. Let's get it. To set up IP Foxy proxy in Ads Power, there are three ways to do this. If you don't have an eFoxy account yet, you can choose the first method. Let's start by creating a profile by clicking on New Profile in Ads Power. You can fill in the rest of the profile information first, then slide under the proxy option. Select IP Foxy dedicated static proxies, and then click on Purchase at IP Foxy. This time jump to eFoxy, the generated account is as power authorized account. You can bend your phone number to get a free trial of the eFoxy proxy, or buy the proxy directly. Here I pick up a free dedicated IPv6 proxy for demonstration purposes. Successful claim, it will automatically go to the proxy management page. Purchased proxy information can be viewed here. And you can also change the proxy protocol here. Then without any operation, the proxy information has been synchronized to as power. Go back to as power and select the proxy that needs to be set up. That's the first method. If you already have an eFoxy account, we recommend you to do it through method 2 and method 3. Now let's demonstrate method 2 first. Go to the iPFoxy website and log into your account. I already have buying proxies in my account. Click view token under the account avatar. Copy the account token. Go to as power and click proxy in proxy configuration. When you see the eFoxy area, scroll down to the bottom to see the dedicated static proxy. Paste the token you just copied. Click save setting first, then click sync proxy. This means that any eFoxy proxies you purchase after that will be automatically synchronized to as power. You just need to select the proxy you need when you create a new profile. This is the second method all. Finally, let's demonstrate the third method. Go to eFoxy and find the proxy information you need to configure. Click the copy icon next to the proxy information to copy the proxy information. Go back to as power and click on proxy add proxy. Paste the proxy information and save it. Then when you create a new profile, you can select save the proxies and proxy to complete the configuration. That's all. That's the end of today's sharing, so feel free to follow me.